Hey everyone, happy Monday. Uh, I've just come on, I've had a question about how much I've been losing each week. Um, as someone's lost a good amount on the first week, but on the second they've only lost a pound and a half. I'd be buzzing with a pound and a half. Absolutely buzzing. So I thought I would just come on and tell you exactly what I've lost each week. Um, so my first week I lost six and a half pound. Second week was two and a half. Third, three. Then one and a half, three, two, two and a half, one and a half, five, half pound, three and a half, two and a half, a pound, two and a half. Then I had a holiday. Three pound, one and a half, one and a half, two pound, a half. Two pound, then I'd maintain, which was over Christmas. I was super chuffed with that. And then one and a half, then we got our new books. And then it was one and a half, a half, one and a half, a holiday, a maintain, and one and a half. So I'm in the one and a half clubs for a lot of the time, uh, and more at the start. Now, We've got to think that we're not all the same. Don't go comparing yourself to other people. Other people lose weight only half a pound a week. Others, you know, two pounds, three pounds, it flies off. But does it stay off? I don't know. Um, but I, all I can say is I would be so happy with a pound and a half after my second week. Because don't forget, you've had a massive loss. And then your body's got to regulate itself. So it's got to find that balance of losing, you know, a sensible amount each week you're not going to be losing four or five pounds each week um but if you stick to plan you're going to be losing half one one and a half two two and a half you know it's if you put in 50 percent, you're only going to get 50 percent out if you put in 100 percent, you're going to get 100 percent out so i have done this this week which is my food journal so, um, I made creamy garlic mushrooms on Saturday, Tagliatelle, from the magazine. The magazine's really good this week. It's got a lot of recipes in that are really nice. Uh, last night, we had an Aldi meal, which was barbecue chicken, um, and I made Hasselback potatoes. So, for that, for that whole meal from Aldi, it was one ninety nine, and it was once in for the whole thing so me and my husband had half each so making that meal half a sin I mean that's you know fantastic so for tonight uh, we're going to have the Aldi chicken sarg with extra veg uh, that was two sins for the whole thing and that again was one ninety nine. so I'll only be having half so for you know for a whole meal that's one sin but I'm packing it out with speed more speed food uh, then tomorrow I've got cardin butter sauce with veggies, which is only two and a half sins for the cardin butter sauce. Then I've got a chicken and veg with gravy. Um, I've got a full English down here, which will just be one of everything. Um, I'll either get half a sin sausage or go to local butchers and try and get fat free ones. Uh, and then the last day, on Friday, it was just something simple, beans on toast or egg on toast or something like that. Something light for the next day so that I haven't got that mass weighing uh, on me heavy. But yeah, to you who has lost one and a half in your second week, that is fantastic. And the worst thing you can do is go home and stuff your face because you're not happy with it. Because you've now got to work hard to get that off, whatever it is you've put on. I would rather have a one and a half loss than a gain. I've been doing this now for nearly seven months. I've had no gain. I've put, I haven't put 100% into it, I'll be honest. Um, the days that I have put 100% in are the ones that where I've got the higher losses. You know, um, I put in what I feel I want to. Um, I've only got six and a half pounds to go. It's going to be harder to get off. 
but I'm going to do it. And if that's half a pound a week, then that's half a pound a week, but it's going to stay off, isn't it? So don't be stuffing your face. Don't be hard on yourself. Don't be down on yourself. It's amazing. You've lost, you've lost one and a half pounds. You've not maintained or put on. I mean, even a maintain, you haven't got to work hard at losing weight that you've put on the week before. It's a maintain. So you're starting from there, you know, to lose half a pound or a pound. Uh, if you've put a pound on, a pound and a half, you've got to work extra hard and put 100% in to get that off. And if you want a little bit more, it's up to you. Um, but don't, it's not worth it, stuffing your face um, and, you know, having a binge because you've put, you know, you've lost a pound and a half and you weren't happy because if you put on this week, you've got to work hard to get that off. So... You know, come on, have a good week, write it down, write everything down. In your first week, you're given your pack, your book. Uh, we all had our new books, our new packs. There's my book. There's all my shinies on that I've worked hard for. And on this side, my Miss Slinky. There's my three and a half and a Slimmer of the Week. I'm still getting Slimmer of the Week even now. So stick at it work hard and you will see the benefits if you've got any more questions let me know but please write everything down every single sin that you have every single little bit of food that goes in your mouth write it down and in your packs you will have got a sheet to write it down if you haven't got a journal but i do strongly recommend that you get a journal okay so i hope that answers your question and i hope you have a really good week if you are struggling, throw in some SP days. Ask your consultant about um, doing SP. You don't have to do it every day. I do a lot of SP days, which means, you know, dropping carbs, uh, pasta, rice, that kind of thing. No free foods, just speed and protein. That's all you'll be having. So try having a couple of those days. That might help. Try having more low sin things. That might help. But even you drinking that, make sure you sin it. Okay, so any more questions? I hope that's answered uh, what you were after. Any more questions, just let me know. Okay, been watching Blonde Blogger. Thank you. Have a good Monday.